Hey everyone, here is a demonstration of a voting application built with the Enigma protocol. The application maintains voter privacy by allowing the results of a poll to be computed without ever leaking a user's particular vote itself. The first thing to note is this dashboard up top. We have a menu with the test network accounts at your disposal, and we'll keep this initialized to the first user for now. Current token balance refers to the number of mintable tokens the user has purchased. We have a simple exchange rate of 10 tokens for one Ether. Stake tokens refers to a portion of these voting tokens that the user is willing to commit to the voting contract. We've implemented a token-weighted voting system here, and as such, at any given point, the user is allowed to vote with a max weight equal to the stake token amount. This first user will start by purchasing 10 tokens and staking 5 of these to the contract. We'll go ahead and create our very first poll, which requires a few bits of information. Quorum percentage mandates that in order for a poll to successfully pass, the number of yes votes divided by the total number of votes needs to exceed this quorum. We'll institute a simple majority of 50. For description, we can ask a question such as, is privacy important for voting? Very topical. And for voting period, we can enter a 60 second window that this poll will remain active. We'll go ahead and create this poll and you can see that it in fact has now been registered. The first user would like to vote in this poll with a weight of 5 and say, yes, privacy is very important for voting. This vote has been now cast, but more importantly, note how this vote has been saved. It's been saved as an encrypted bytes representation of the vote itself. We do not store yes or no, 1 or 0. To reiterate, we store the encrypted vote only, thereby not exposing the vote itself to a third party. We'll change accounts here to the second user, purchase five voting tokens, stake all five to the contract, and this time, with a weight of three, vote no. Once again, you can see how this vote has been cast in encrypted form. Once the timer ends, the poll will automatically end, triggering a very important function in our framework, the callable function. This function runs the secret computation inside secure SGX enclaves on the Enigma network, decrypts the votes, tallies the results, and then subsequently triggers a callback function, which is in charge of altering the contract state with the updated poll status. For those of you keeping count, we had effectively five yes votes and effectively three no votes, passing the simple majority. Thus, as expected, this poll passed. And this is rendered with a front-end event watcher waiting for the callback to emit an event upon completion, indicated by this green check mark signifying that the poll has indeed passed. Awesome! Well, that about wraps things up. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration of how voter privacy can be maintained using the Enigma protocol. Thanks!